Okay, so we are at the Nomad. It is room 2978. We'll start here in the bathroom. So from the entryway, it's a nice wooden door. I like the colors in here. So you have, you have a single sink, but you've got lots of space. Nice big mirror area down underneath where you can put stuff. I have my bag down there. And then, you know, you just show you the toilet space. And then, you have this big shower, which I really like. Let me see how it opens, okay. So, it doesn't even, you know, even slide it. So, you've got a nice, Large shower. Looks like an adjustable head on that. And you turn it on way over here. Which is interesting. I'll let you know how that works. And you've got a couple cow hanging cows. So this is a nice, very nice bathroom. Okay. So off of the entryway, there's the door, there's the bathroom, and here's your closet. And light comes on. So uh, I've already got some of my stuff in here, but you've got a steamer, plenty of hangers, a couple robes, a couple pairs of slippers, your luggage rack, and you've still got a full mirror here. So nice closet space. I like it a lot. Okay, and then from the entryway, just have this little entryway, a couple little pictures here. But you've got this nice space, and it's 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 nicely decorated. It's I really like this room. Nice touches. So the safe and drawers, you really got three drawers over here. Down here, like, you know, if you wanted to store anything in there, it does have um, glasses to use, water that you can buy. All that stuff is uh, on the sensor, along with the refrigerator is on a sensor. But, uh, and I'm not going to open it. Everything, it's, it's stocked. So um, they offered to bring up a refrigerator for free that we can use. So that's going to be brought up here in just a little bit. We got the king size bed. And nice touches. Table, the clock. The lighting is not overly bright. And then coming from this direction. You've got a little table, your your TV, a couple chairs. Let's look at our plug situation. So in here you got two plugs and two USBs. Let's see what if we have anything on the sides over here. So yes, you do. You have a couple USBs back there and one plug. And then Looks like you have it on the side as well. So yes, I don't know if you can see that. It's behind this. So you do have lots of plugs. You have this nice big couch right here. And I have not looked to see what our uh, view is of. So let's look at the arena. We have the T-Mobile Arena right there. Lots of you have the 15 Freeway. Over there you have a little bit of New York, New York. You can see the Delano, Mandalay is over there. Right here is the Park MGM. We're in the Nomad. So overall, this looks like a very nice room. Um, we just came from Planet Hollywood, so this is really a very big step up from Planet Hollywood. But we will let you know how it goes over the next two days.
So this is just a wrap up of the Nomad. So we were here two nights. Uh, let's start with check-in because I think that was a, a great experience. We pulled up into Valet. There was nobody here. Um, they helped us inside very quickly. They even got somebody for the desk because it was so quiet. Nobody was out front at the desk. It's very, it feels very luxurious here. Um, I, the people were wonderful. I, I would say that part of the experience was really good. The room, now it just depends. If you like this kind of furnishings, then you're gonna love it here. If you're more like that, like the hipster kind of uh, Planet Hollywood thing, that you might not like it here. It's more of the um, the darker furnishings, um, heavier furnishings. So uh, the bed was good. The bed was comfortable. The pillows were okay, but they gave you four big pillows, so at least I, I, I'm not complaining that it was uh, a nice night's sleep. Um, the uh, couple chairs were really great. The couch, not so comfortable, but um, it looks nice. <laughs> it's in front of the window. Our view was of the, um, the arena, uh, so I mean it was okay. Um, we didn't ask for a view. Um, so it was just, uh, it was, it was okay. It wasn't a, a full on strip view or anything like that. So, um, this room only had the bar refrigerator, but they offered to bring a refrigerator for free for us if we needed it. So they did, they brought one up. So that was nice. We used that one night. Um, the bathroom was plenty big. That shower is nice. It gets hot, has great pressure. You've got plenty of room to um, angle it where you want it. Um, it was just, uh, this whole room was very nice. Uh, the casino below, you have to go to, you know, you're connected to Park uh, MGM. So uh, you go through a class door and you're in, you're in the casino. Uh, we did a little bit of gambling there. Uh, won a little bit, lost a little bit. It just, um, you know, it was fun. Um, 
eating here, you've got options. Uh, you've got Italy out there. So right there, you've got lots of Italian type food, pizza. Uh, we, we went down there and ate last night for dinner. This came with $50 of a, a resort credit. So I put that food toward um, my room and that should be take the $50 should be taken off by today. So um, it works out that it's so close. You could also use that credit elsewhere, like in New York, New York, which is right across the way. Um, that's really the only food option that we went to. We did see another few other options here. Um, there's a noodle place. Um, there's best friends. So you had choices, but I mean, more likely if we wanted to eat something else, we probably would have went over to New York, New York and went over to Greenberg's Deli or Fulton Fish Fry or something like that. Something easy, but you have a lot more choices there. Or you can even take the tram over and go over to Bellagio or even Art. You can go right over to Aria. So you have lots of choices. You're very close. You're on the strip. Um, so that, that was nice. And um, Nomad has its own pool, but it's closed during the week. So I went over to the Park MGM pool, which is like right out that glass door and around a corner and you're there. So, um, and then they had three pools and they were all open. It was a little busy, but it wasn't overly so. There was plenty of chairs. And then on the weekend when it's gonna get busy and it will get busy this weekend, um, they will have the Nomad pool open. So um, you will have more options. Um, so I think that overall, this was a great stay, a great place. I would absolutely come back here.